In what had been a peaceful Saturday afternoon on a holiday weekend, the immediate aftermath of a ballistic missile attack, the apparent target, a theatre in a city centre miles away from any fighting. At least seven are dead, among them a six-year-old girl. More than a hundred are injured, among them a dozen children. People in Chernihiv had no idea this was coming. The attack came as President Zelensky was in Sweden. President Zelensky, let me first of all express my heartfelt condolences to you for the horrible Russian attack against Chernihiv and the loss of life. It's an act of brutality which we condemn from Sweden. Zelensky is there to continue lobbying for fighter jets he hopes will neutralize the threat of these kinds of attacks. We don't have superiority in the air and we don't have modern aircraft. In reality, the Swedish Gripen is the pride of your country and I believe that the Prime Minister could share this pride with Ukraine. We would also be very proud of it so that the Russians don't have an advantage there. Ukrainian media is reporting the theatre had been hosting a meeting of drone makers. The regional governor called the attack an act of terror. All the victims are being provided with medical care. All the authorities are working and the response headquarters has been set up. All affected buildings will be restored shortly and all necessary assistance, including material, will be provided to those affected by the missile strike. Russia is a terrorist. The enemy is a terrorist. The enemy must be destroyed. Vladimir Putin was on Rostov-on-Don overnight, the city where June's mutiny against his government was launched. Instead of military advances, his commanders could only offer him another attack on a civilian target, ending in the slaughter and injury of yet more innocent people. Dominic Waghorn, Sky News. Join the conversation. Put your comments and suggestions below in the comment section. Thank you for subscribing to this news channel. You will be notified of any breaking news and new post as you become part and parcel of the TAO Media family. Please like and share TAO Media. We love you all. Please support TAO Media Foundation by joining membership and visiting Amazon UK to purchase the displayed books to aid our orphanage projects across Africa.